greatest reason in fact is an objection to the portrayal of our national emblem in addition to allegation that its design has been changed the most specific charge is that it has been made muscular aggressive snarling basically nasty purportedly this new aggression is because of sanghification or godsification of the emblem basically that sanghis and people like godse are the ones who are dictating the design element of this new emblem so what's the difference in the look here is what has been pointed out one is that in the new emblem or the emblem that has been made on top of the parliament building the lions are seen bearing their teeth that they look unnecessarily aggressive also hyper muscular very sinewy or as the tmc member of parliament said snarling unnecessarily aggressive and disproportionate this is in contrast to the earlier depiction of the emblem that was calm that was happy almost smiling all these emblems sign emblems they all had been thoroughly discussed and after that they had been established they had been finalized by the successive leadership in last 70 years so i think any kind of tampering in these symbols or uh, you know these rashtriya pratik should not be done now on the back of this it is being said that this act is anti national and is a violation of the state emblem of india act that is by the way the more logical argument the political argument is a whole different story that argument is that this is hyper nationalism post 2014 where everything is aggressive it's violent it's snarling it's not about your calm head of state the statesman it's somebody who is out to be carnivorous and that all of this has been thrust upon a presumably peace loving lion so far